In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your TX wallet to the Bittrex exchange. And this will enable you to use some of the functions like the trading view and also the cross send. So the first thing you need to do is come down to the Bittrex tab and click on that. Now here you can see that we need an API key, a secret key and a password. Now this password is referring to your Bittrex account password. So we will need to get all these three. Once you're in your Bittrex account, you will need to navigate to settings and then to API keys. Next, you'll need to put in your authentication code for your 2FA, which you should be able to access on your device. Mine is 728207 and then click on add new key. Next, click on each off tab and then update keys. You'll now see that we have a secret and a key. You'll need to copy these and put them in a notepad and put these into your TX wallet. Here on the left, I have the secret and the key that I just pasted. I also have my Bittrex account password in my clipboard, okay? Now on the right hand side here, I have the transfer install directory and I wanted to show you this because when we create the connection, it will create a file. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to paste in my Bittrex account password. Next, I will copy the secret key. Now just make sure that you don't have any spaces on the side here because this will uh, cause an error. So we put that into secret and finally the key. Paste that in there. So the first thing you'll need to click on is update API keys and this will make a connection. So we'll do that. You can see that now it is Connected. If I click on OK, you'll notice that all these tabs are now available. Okay. So the next thing we need to do is we need to save the API keys because when we close this wallet, we will need to load them again. Okay. So we need to put our Bittrex account password back in there and then click on Save API Keys. Now you'll notice that when I click on this, it will create a file over here. So I'll click on that and you can see here is the file. Okay. Click on OK. So the next time that we want to close our wallet and we want to reopen it and load this again, make the connection, you'll need to use this option, load API keys. So I will show you that right now. So I have closed and reopened the wallet. Now if we come down to the Bittrex tab, you can see it's actually still connecting. Uh, so all we need to do here is we need to paste in our Bittrex account password, okay, and then just click on load API keys, okay. So now you can see that is a, it has successfully created a connection and everything is good to go. So be sure to check out the other videos on uh, on trading and also on the cross send and be sure to subscribe. Uh, I'll be making sure that there's a lot of videos to cover all aspects of the TX wallet.